So in this science experiment, we're going to show you how water travels um, through the paper towel when you submerge it into the water. And we colored the water with food coloring. That way you can see um, that how this works. We've done this before with just water and a string. We soak the string or put it in a cup of water. And then on the other end of the string, we put it in a uh, pot of a small plants. And then the water traveled up to this uh, string all the way to the plants. So it's kind of a neat experiment. So this one, you'll be able to see uh, the water traveling to the middle cup there from the paper towels. And we're going to be making a secondary color out of the red and blue, which is going to be what Purple. color? Purple. Good. So go ahead, Bella. Um, go ahead and put the paper towel in there. And then you'll put another one under red. So we'll let these cups sit uh, for about eight hours until we got this color in the middle, the purple in the middle there. So the two primary colors, red and blue, makes the secondary purple. And as you can see, the, um, how much water in each cup, they're almost about the same. That's because they're all, all at the same level. Now if you were to put this side, this red higher, maybe put it on top of a block, then you'll get more red in there, making it more red, red purple, and then the same thing with the blue. So if you raise this, you'll get more blue in there um, since the gravity pulls, pulls down. And <clears throat> the reason why the um, water um, was carried through on, into the middle cup is because the fiber, there's only so many uh, air pockets in the fibers of the paper towel. So it acts like a hose or a pipe and it gets too heavy and the excess water drips onto the uh, middle cup there, since the paper, paper towel can only hold so much water. It's been about an hour later and most of the red water dripped down the middle cup of the purple water. And as you can see there, the purple looks more like a burgundy, so it's more of a red purple since there is more red in it. And also the water levels changed um, in the red cup and the purple cup since we elevated the red cup, so most of the water traveled down onto the middle cup here. So this cup has the highest level of water. The blue did not change since we didn't change the um, elevation of it. So this is a water or a, a liquid absorbing science experiment. Now remember there are air pockets in the fibers of the paper towel or a string or other paper products. And those air pockets get uh, filled up with water until it cannot retain any more liquid. So the liquid has to flow somewhere else as the um, paper gets too heavy to retain all that water. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this experiment and it's also neat that you can mix these primary colors to make secondary colors. Um, stay tuned at Learn to Grow. Please subscribe to our channel if you haven't. Thank you. And you can like our Facebook page. It's also in our channel. Have a wonderful day and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.